okay, this is the start of my next vlog. Oh my. Hey. And it's a surprise vlog. And I know I just surprised you with a shirt. Oh no. But other than that. No, no. I don't really sleep on anything, do no, I? No, you really don't. <laughs> I knew you were gonna do that. Babe. Guess what I did on the flight home. Bought us tickets <laughs> to Laguna. <laughs> You're you're nuts. Get out of here, <laughs> babe. We're going. Oh my god. We're going to Laguna, mid September, babe. Catch us there. That's, why you do why okay. you do these things? Because so I went for like one day in the beginning of the summer, which just made me sad because I like wanted to go more and it's one of my favorite places. It is like one of the closest things to heaven on earth. I mean Hawaii probably more, but like. I just love this place, is what I'm trying to say. It's one of my favorite places. I love Laguna so much, and so I just want to share it with you. It's very sweet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I want to tell you right now, because I was scared that since I put in your name and your like travel number that you were going to get an email. Uh, so, I'm, did you see it? No. Oh, that you like knew already or something. So I was scared you were going to get an email. Even though I put in my email as the contact email because oh. I didn't want you yeah. to get an email, but I thought maybe you still would anyway. I don't know. Well, that's exciting. Ooh. That was like very spontaneous. But very. Like, like I was like, I want to go, mm -hmm. and then I just booked them. I love booking a trip before I'm done with the current trip, because mm -hmm. then I have something else to be excited for. I, I have so much to be excited for in the next couple of weeks. I feel like we have so many plans. Yes, we do. And even this weekend, and we're going to a wedding, <coughs> and then the weekend after, we're like, good I think we just made it a long weekend, like it's a Thursday through a Monday. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's exciting. So excited. Mmm. I'm so excited. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can eat now, but I just yeah. wanted to tell you because I wouldn't be able to hold it in. Oh, thank you. <laughs> that's exciting. Okay, continuing on with the vlog. Okay, you guys, this evening has not gone as expected. <laughs> like 6 30 it's dinner time and i was eating my sweet green salad and my fork suddenly broke in half and the rest of my salad fell on the ground which was like one bite obviously look at my falafel on the ground with half the fork in it i think it was hard so it broke my fork oh my god bye queen i know we just hung out for like 30 minutes it was great <laughs> but we'll see you when we see you, yeah. I have to update my vlog. I didn't end up going to Seoul. Oh. Are you are you shocked? Vlog. Uh, uh, uh. ah, it's just talking about my vlog. Oh wait, 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 wait! I didn't tell them. Oh wait, wait! I'm so ADD. Please show them that. <laughs> guys, guys, come with me. Look at. Look at what? Do you see this view? I can't make that. I'm looking at the view, baby. <laughs> and to the, the sky. <laughs> Look at it. Here, I'll focus it. <laughs> Wait, like, it's so pretty. It is, looks, looks way cooler in real life than it does. And there's a couple dogs down there. And the best view is down at the dog park. What's he doing? What's he doing? <laughs> He's probably trying to pee. Let him pee and pee. Okay, I have to update you. If I'm being completely honest, I hate when I do this. I slept through my soul cycle class and I hate when I do that. I honestly like never do that anymore because for the early ones, my body just like knows I have to be awake. But I was so tired from all this travel in such Whoa. a short amount of time. Yeah. And wait, I'm coming, why do you have golf clubs? Oh, yeah. But yeah, I got back from the airport and hugged Max for a second and then I said, see ya. And I napped so long and I woke up like right before the class would have started and I was like I'm so exhausted because I went to surprise Ma I was about to say Chase's sister Max's sister Chase um, In New York this morning because she was teaching a class at 6 a.m. So I got up at 5 15 So I feel so out of it still, but obviously my nap helped but I said I was going to Seoul I didn't end up at Seoul, but I'm going in the morning anyway And I knew that would have been a lot if I went at 5 o'clock tonight and oh my god I look like a boy with no hair right now <laughs> Like I was saying, I was supposed to go at 5, but I'm going at 9.30 in the morning anyway. So, yeah, that would have, like, been a lot. And I'm happy that I took the rest. 
that my body needed. I feel like I've been seeing a lot on Instagram people being like, like I feel like everyone's so, like the culture of like, everyone should hustle and get after it all day every day and like workaholic, but it like literally isn't the healthiest thing for you. I was no like, days off! Get yeah. after it! Yeah, like student athlete grind, like hunted, like you know what I mean? <laughs> but like, no, it's good to freaking take care of yourself and like nap if you need a nap because you haven't been sleeping or you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Yeah, that's what that reminded me of. Are you using your rangefinder? How far away am I? Am I too close? Guys, we had so much fun with that if you've played with those when you go golfing. Look, I like. Let's guys, see how far away. You can see how far away the Prudential Tower is. Do the dog, tell me how close it is. It's so funny, you can point that things out the window and see how close things is. It tells you like meters, right? Yards. Oh, yards, okay, that's close. What's the American version? Yards, no, 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 yeah. I don't know, I think meters is like the other country. Why? It up. My pimples are like going away, but you know when they like are weird. It's dark out. Oh, it's too dark. Sorry, I'm so out. I am taking Brooke to her first class in the morning. I'm so excited! because if you guys know if you're like into solar spin or whatever you're passionate about when you get to like bring somebody else new that's new like into the experience and the environment and the community it is like such a fun feeling like I love bringing people for their first time like I just get so excited and want them to enjoy it and have a good time and then after I'm like what'd you think what'd you like like what was hardest what was the best what was your favorite like so I'm just so excited now are you seeing if you can do it to me he's all the way in my closet Seven yards. Seven yards? Yeah. Too far away. Are you counting how many feet? <laughs> By the length of your feet? 19. 19. 21, close enough. Is how many? Don't, you know the answer to that. Three yes. feet and a yard. Okay, can we please go to Chipotle? Wait, that was perfect, because you said seven yards and then it was 21 feet. That's why. Chipotle is my wife. Okay, but yeah, so all I was saying is I'm really excited to go to Seoul in the morning with Brooke. It'll be like right after this. Oh my god, I can't wait. It's gonna be hard. Like everyone's first class is hard. Like I honestly hated my first three. I always talk about that and how it took me like really like three classes to be like, oh, I can like keep up if I just turn down the resistance or, you know, like to get into it. But I'm just so excited to bring her. And Max is starving. Oh, look at this poor hungry boy. May I please have a burrito? <laughs> this poor little puppy's hungry. I'm full because I'm my green salad and and a lot of cake if you guys remember when I made my chocolate peanut butter vegan cake the other day it's still going strong sorry I'm so distracted by the view and oh okay he needs a burrito but so I ate like half of chocolate peanut butter cake and I kind of feel sick I'm like a dog that ate the whole bag of treats and now their stomach hurts ow it really does you would think I would learn after all these years. I'm 22. I really cannot feed myself properly. It's just a work in progress, you know? Wow, I love this like cozy chat laying on my bed. Isn't this great? We should do this more often. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. <laughs> I fed my boyfriend, everybody. Double wrapped burrito. Uh, welcome to our new channel of, of mukbangs. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. I literally just woke up, so sorry if I'm like slow moving right now or my voice sounds morning-ish, but I feel like this is like overexposed. I have like big news for you, so let's move over here. Better? Yeah, okay. I wanted to come out into the kitchen. Max is sleeping. I'll talk quietly. I wanted to come out into the kitchen so that I could have like good natural lighting so you could see some things because I have big news. Okay, so not to say that this is a miracle product, but I think it is and I'm just like Surprised but like really excited. Okay. Anyway, if you guys know I've been struggling with my eczema so bad And I'm gonna try to get like really close so you can see or actually I don't even know what it is really cuz I still haven't seen a dermatologist Which I know is bad and I've been wanting to I've just been really busy like I was just traveling da -da -da, Whatever I know I should make an appointment and really see a dermatologist um because a lot of you were like i don't even know how to say the word it's like this kind of dermatitis which is like different than eczema you know, like you shouldn't be using eczema cream on it and a lot of people are like you need to just like stick with really simple like cleanser moisturizer because i feel like i'm always using crazy different stuff but when we were just in new york and we went to Classier and i like went ham 
I got this moisturizer because I was like, that looks like a really thick, nice moisturizer. I always like using thick ones. I have such dry skin and also my eczema problem. It was so bad when I was in New York. It has been so bad. Like literally bright red, like just peeling off, like almost like blistering. Sorry, that's gross. If you guys like have this issue, then maybe you know. And I never had to deal with it and it was like so bad. I'm just like so shocked. Like I just woke up. I've used it for two nights in a row. Yesterday morning, I was like, why does it look so much better? And then this morning especially, I'm like, it is like almost gone. I think this moisturizer like cleared my skin overnight. Is it like something else that I was like eating that was like a miracle? I ate a bunch of chocolate cake yesterday. Was that it? I don't think so. This is the Glossier. Uh, that's in a different language. Glossier Priming Moisturizer Rich Luxurious Face Cream. And really the reason I liked it is because it smells like kind of like lavender ginger almost. I don't even know if there's ginger in here, but it kind of smells like ginger to me. Um, really lavender-y though, and it just smelled really good for like nighttime, like calming, like lavender would help me sleep. It smells so good, and it's just this thick moisturizer. I don't know what about it, but like I wish you could have seen in New York. I know you've seen in videos past. Like my skin was bright red and cracking, and it's still, I want to make sure you guys can like see how much better it is. It's still really dry, and you can still see like redness da, 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 and like dryness, but not nearly as like the redness is almost gone. Like it just feels a little dry. I literally think this like cleared my skin overnight. Sorry, I'm just like freaking out, but I am like really excited because I've been so insecure about it, and it's like so weird to me because I feel like I'm such a confident person normally. But I like think back to I'm gonna like cry. <laughs> I think back to my freshman year of high school and. I got really bad acne and if you guys remember like from the beginning, why am I gonna cry? <laughs> I just feel like confidence and like stuff like that is so like emotional to me. Okay, where is this coming from? Like what is going on this Saturday morning? But I would have like, and I know so many of you can relate, like a face full of acne and I like felt like I had to paint my face for like two hours before school every day and I just like hated it so much and was so insecure and like I know this sounds dramatic, but I almost started to feel that way again when I started to get this like eczema, whatever it was, I don't know. Cause I'm like, this is all I notice when I like look at my face. Like I feel like that's all everyone else notices. And I know everyone's like their own worst critic. Like literally no one notices things about you more than you that you don't like, you know what I mean? Like most people don't notice it at all actually. And it's like just you. Um, but yeah, I'm just really excited that I found this cause I think it's like clearing it up. It's just this like nice, like moisturizer this I just like had to show you guys because I just woke up and was like it's so much better and I'm just gonna put it on my skin because I'm about I was like I was telling you yesterday oh, my skin's so sensitive see how it gets like red right as I rub stuff on it um I'm going to pick up Brooke right now for our first soul cycle class and I'm just so excited and I didn't want her to have to worry about parking or anything I was like girl it's your first experience I'm gonna come scoop you I'll find parking since I'm the parking wizard in Back Bay and we're gonna go and it's gonna be great. Oh, okay, one other thing. So this I think is a miracle product. I would recommend if you have like dry skin or if you want like some lavender scented nice moisturizer for like nighttime. I'm gonna keep you guys updated on this journey. Maybe it was the chocolate cake, maybe it was something else. I don't know, but I think it's this. Um Okay, then I use this Glossier Solution Exfoliating Skin Perfector. If you guys remember, I started using the mm, Dr. Dennis Gross, that's what it's called, face peel like pad things, and I felt like they were really abrasive. I felt like I wanted like an everyday, like, ah, uh, like exfoliating type thing that would make my pores smaller and like less gunk in my skin, and I felt like I noticed a difference with my pores and like my nose and like areas like that, but I felt like it was really abrasive in my skin and definitely was not helping my like eczema down here. Oh, I feel like you can like see it better now, because I was just rubbing moisturizer down it. But, See how this still looks like pretty bad? It was like a million times worse. So anyway, I was talking to this guy at Glossier Forever. He was so helpful and he was like, this I feel like is like less abrasive. And he was like, I have really sensitive skin so it's almost like too much. And you're supposed to put it on and like leave it there and then develop with like a moisturizer. And I think he said he puts it on and kind of like washes it off because it can be like a lot for his, his skin. And he was like, um, I actually, oh, I think he was saying for this one, your skin actually like purges when you start like new products and maybe that's even what happened because I literally got a pimple here and here last night too so like good news bad news good news this is going away bad news I got two pimples but 
I also, when I use this, I only put it like here, my nose, my forehead. Like I stayed away from my chin that's already like too dry and just didn't want to mess with it. Um, but I feel like I like this too. So I'm excited about this. It's just a salicylic acid acne treatment. 10% AHA, BHA, PHA. So I think you just have to be like careful with this and I feel like these things say that you can use them daily but someone was DMing me and they were like, it can be a lot on your skin, like use it every couple days or like once a week or whatever. So okay, I'm gonna do that. And a couple more things. I need to go pick up work, we need to go. But um, this Glossier Milk Jelly Cleanser Conditioning Face Wash. Literally when Glossier started a million years ago, I got stuff from them and I remember I tried this and I think I was like, oh, whatever, and like gave it to my sister and I was like, I'm not obsessed with it, like I don't really care. I have other cleansers because I was using those like crazy abrasive like St. Ives, like Neutrogena, like intense exfoliating ones that I thought were like gonna make my skin good and it was like, way too much i was going overboard and i was using them like every day and like gentle like nice cleansers that you should be using every day like this i was ignoring um so i just started using this again and i just really like it and i feel like it's a really other good cleanser that's like gentle everyday natural for me to use i should probably stick to like a couple i use so many i use a purity one i use a bio clarity one i use what is the other one I use? Oh, Cetaphil sometimes because I feel like that's what my dermatologist back in the day when I had really bad acne, like <laughs> seven years ago, um, always used to recommend like Cetaphil CeraVe. So yeah, but I really like this one and I feel like it's just like natural, like so gentle. Okay, then if you guys remember, look, none of this is sponsored. I just wanted to give you an update. <laughs> this morning, I put on the Native Cucumber Mint because normally I use the coconut, vanilla coconut, that's what it's called. It has like the brown letter packaging, but I got a couple flavors since, so I wanted to try this this morning, and it smells really good, so keep you updated on how that goes. And last but not least, I mostly use my birthdaybomb.com because it smells so good, but sometimes I use the mango because it tastes like you're biting into a legit mango. It's so amazing. I always go like this, get a little on my lips, rub it around. Like it literally feels like I just ate a mango. Okay, let's go to Seoul. I'm gonna stop crying. <laughs> I mean, much. Oh, also, I wanted to show you though. I got this sports bra from Aloe in New York, um, and I actually went ham and ordered a bunch more stuff from Aloe last night because I love their stuff. I felt like I didn't have that much time to like try on like um, really explore in their store, so I just got like two things for myself, and I love this. I got it to match a pair of leggings that I have, um, and. I, yeah, I just ordered a bunch more stuff last night, so that's my update. Let's go to Seoul. I'm so excited. Look who it is. Oh, happy Saturday. Hi. I'm nervous. You look so cute oh for this God, adventure. I'm so nervous, you guys. I really am. I got like all worked up last night. Oh like, my God. It's going to be so fun. Because you're going to be so good and I'm going to be like, Shoot, No, it's going like... to be so fun. Okay. Literally my first class, I like chilled. And I think I, oh, hello. <laughs> I think I hated my first like three because okay, you like okay, okay. just don't have the hang of it and you're not yeah. gonna do like the arms and stuff because it's your first time. Okay, but okay, okay. It'll be good. Let's I'm get sure it. There will be like other beginners. Oh, I also have a surprise. Oh my god. It's an hour class, not 45 minutes. Compression! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> no. But you actually, okay. Anyone that's watching that's been to Seoul, you don't notice the difference between the two because okay. it's 15 minutes of difference. Okay, like, you literally okay, don't notice okay, the difference. Okay. And since it's your first time, you'll just always be ready for the hour one. Oh, I'm so out of shape. This is really bad. No, it'll be okay, okay, so okay, good. Okay, okay, okay. And and I okay, I feel like my biggest tip is my first one. I just had the resistance on really like high. Just take it off and then it's yeah. Easier, no, I'm gonna you know? definitely because it's like a fast pace. So like. The lower the resistance is, the easier it'll be. So. Okay, I'm definitely gonna keep it on. Yeah, yeah we'll be there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous. Brooks first soul cycle locker. Brooks first soul cycle shoes. <laughs> I've done it before. I did it that one time. Oh yeah. yeah Wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So where did you do it now, before? Where's that? Okay. Woodbury. 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 Yeah. Woodbury. I've been to Woodbury. It's, it's okay. Like I will say, this one is like a little like vibes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And then it's gonna be so great, everyone. This I just got this in New York, so I'm so excited to wear it for the first time. I really like Wait, this. feel how soft it is. Do you have like anything from Aloe? It is like they have this really soft like material stuff. Really like it feels that. like a blanket. I really like this. This is perfect. We're wearing like the same sports bra style. I love it. This was good. It's from I love wearing high neck ones because then my boobs don't fall out. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't feel like riding up, and I'm like, mm, everyone can see my 
and I'm flipping it now, it's fine. I was like, I'm sure when I saw it, and then I was like, yeah. probably not my Because you're like leaning forward, so I feel yeah, like it's yeah, a lot, yeah, yeah. but no, this is gonna be great. Yeah, wait, I can't wait to film you after. Oh, yeah. Keep Guys, Rick so did so well. You did so good. Really? I feel like on the slower ones, you were like on the beat, too. Really? Oh my god. Thank you, you did so good. good. And I feel like you were doing so well on the weights, too. Oh, thank you. And I like well, large theory, you do like a beat of when I used to do that. Like it's yeah. all weights, you know? So, so you're it's like, yeah. Like, and like the form and stuff, like it's all like the little like movements and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it was fun. I liked yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> I could tell definitely that it was the hour. I was like, you don't notice the difference. I did this time. That felt so. Yeah. <laughs> but I was that was sneaky, Gretchen. I was like, I know. I was like, I was ambitious. I was like, we won't tell her. I feel so good about myself. And it's yeah, only you feel so good after that. Even when I'm like really tired during class, like I literally was like feeling like I had to drink the weight. I was like, after you feel so good, so it's like so you just gotta get through it. Real master. Max got one burger, you guys, because I didn't want a burger. So we got one burger from Whole Foods. <laughs> How's it going? Um. We also got stuff for our salad that we love to make. I just threw the avocado on top so I didn't have to carry it, but I still have to cut that up, put it in. We have strawberries, as you can see, and there's mixed greens underneath, but I had some romaine I wanted to use up, so I just put that on top. And we always do cranberries, walnuts, we got this new dressing that Max said his mom always gets, and then it's like really good. And then we have like just our ranch and balsamic that we like. And then Max's burger stuff. And he grilled chicken too, which is so good. All of this in a salad is like the best thing ever, and you definitely should try it. All right, you guys, our friends just got here. Well, Max's friend, Tyler, but Birdie is what we call him. And then his girlfriend, Ange, and we're all going out to dinner, and I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm wearing this top from Aritzia that I've been waiting to wear. I think it's so cute. And then this skirt is from Princess Polly. I'm trying to figure out the right shoes to wear with. So that is what's going on. I'm so excited. I'm wearing like mostly Glossier. I am obsessed with their stuff. I'm using their concealer, mascara, and I'm just about to straighten my hair a little. I haven't done that in a while, but yeah. And then I'll probably do some Glossier lip gloss. I'm like obsessed with their side of morning, you guys. Oh man, do you hear my voice? Sometimes I feel like if I'm vlogging in the morning and I just woke up, the vlog is like the first thing I talk to and so my voice just sounds like this. Sorry. At least how it is. It's just showing Max though. I use this like all day again yesterday and like what the heck? My eczema, whatever it is, dry skin, dermatitis, like the thing that I've been so insecure about is literally disappearing with this. Like I don't know. I don't know. All I'm saying is that is some magical stuff. I will like find a link for it down below. If you guys, I don't know. I feel like anyone should use it because it's just like a thick, nice moisturizer that I would use at night. But I actually use it like all day long because I have such dry skin, um, which is so weird because I feel like my skin used to be oily. I feel like things just change sometimes. I'm so out of it. I'm so tired. Obviously, I didn't vlog it dinner or anything, but it was like so amazing and so fun. We went to Davio's last night with our friends and oh it was so good it was like a three hour like experience any of you guys have been it was like wild um we got steak and like my favorite thing ever is chocolate lava cake so good um but i feel like i've been vlogging like a lot because i talked about the moisturizer for like i don't know 20 minutes yesterday because i was just like so impressed by it um and obviously brooke's first soul cycle so yeah, I'm gonna end this off here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I need to tell you guys, I ordered this headband from, what even says on there, Slip. Like this Slip Silk brand where my hair ties are from that I always wear in my silk pillowcase and obsessed. And I saw that they had this headband and I was like, that's gonna be so good for when I do. Let's see, I haven't even done one. My hair has been down. Um, but like right now, I want to put on my moisturizer because, like I said, I just wear it all the time. My skin, like, literally feels dry when I wake up. <laughs> but isn't it, like, cute? And it just keeps your hair out of the way. So now I can put on my moisturizer. It's funny with my hair down. I feel like I'm in, like, the third grade when everyone would wear headbands. But I, like, Mac put it on and literally look cute. Mm. You look cute in it. But I feel like normally I do it, like, with my hair up. But I just think it's cute. I'll link this down below, too, if you guys are interested because I really like it. Yeah. Okay. So I put on my moisturizer.
It smells so good. I love the smell of lavender, so. And I know it's probably like common and feels safe for you to go to sleep and obviously I'm like waking up. Um, I feel like last time I just showed my after workout like a skincare routine and I showed using my setup and moisturizer so I need to chill and like use one thing at a time because I kind of use a lot of things. But all I know is for the past couple days, I've just been using the milk jelly cleanser um, or purity to like because that would really help to get my makeup off. I actually heard that the milk jelly cleanser from Glossier helps take your makeup off really well too, but I just like didn't even try. Um, so I should try that. And then this, so that's like all I've been doing. And literally, something's happening correctly because this has literally changed everything. I know I already ended up the vlog, so love you guys.